everyone welcome to medical dialogues your daily dose of health and medical news i'm mr zaman and today i'm going to talk about blood pressure drug may be a potential treatment for ptsd there is new evidence that a 50 year old blood pressure drug could find new purpose as a treatment to mitigate the often life altering effects of increasingly prevalent ptsd scientists say clonidine is commonly used as a high blood pressure medication and for adhd it's also already been studied in ptsd because clonidine works on adrenergic receptors in the brain likely best known for their role in flight or fight clonidine sister drug guanfacine which also activates these receptors also has been studied in ptsd scientists have lab evidence that while the two drugs bind to the same receptors they do different things there their results published in the journal molecular psychiatry suggest that clonidine could provide immediate treatment to the significant number of people emerging from the current pandemic with ptsd as well as from longer established causes like wars and other violence The new studies looked in genetically modified mice as well as neurons that came from human stem cells which have the capacity to make many cell types. The scientists found clonidine interferes with coffelin's exit by encouraging it to interact with the receptor which consequently interferes with the dendritic spines ability to resume a mushroom shape and retain the memory. Guanfacine on the other hand had no effect on this key player coffelin. There was also living evidence in their studies that mimicked how PTSD happens. Mice were given a mild shock, then treated with clonidine right after they were returned to the place when they received the shock and should be recalling what happened earlier. Clonidine treated mice had a significantly reduced response like freezing in their tracks compared to untreated mice when brought back to the scene. In fact, their response was more like the mice who were never shocked. Guanfacine had no effect on freezing behavior. Adrenergic drugs like clonidine bind to receptors in the central nervous system to reduce blood levels of the stress hormones you produce like adrenaline and norepinephrine which do things like increase blood pressure and heart rate. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.